question. A drug used during MRI tests is now at the center of a multi-million dollar lawsuit, and the man taking on those drug manufacturers is none other than action star Chuck Norris. Take a look. According to court documents, martial artist and actor Chuck Norris claims that doctors injected the chemical gadolinium into his wife, Gina Norris. The drug is supposed to improve the image clarity of MRIs. Norris claims that it left his wife weak and tired and dealing with debilitating bouts of pain and a burning sensation. The Food and Drug Administration said it's found no evidence gadolinium is harmful. The law firm representing Norris has filed several lawsuits from people who claim to suffer from gadolinium poisoning. They accuse drug manufacturers of knowing that the drug poisons or pose health risks, but fail to warn consumers. And welcome back to The Factor Uncensored. Kunal Karana says he too has had a life-changing health problems as a result of this drug, and he's joining us now. He is here on the show. Tell us, first of all, how your journey began. At 15 year, years old, you were diagnosed with kidney disease. Yes, sir. And then at 17, you needed a catheter to undergo dialysis. Yes. And as a result of that, you had an MRI. Yes, and what happened after that? So I had an MRI, and... Um they gave me this contrast, and um, at the time I didn't know the name. I didn't really care about the name. I mean, and that's a gadolinium. Gadolinium. They told me, um, this is what you need. Um, we took it and went home. That was it. And I think that was in around that was December, June, uh, December, January time. Mm -hmm. And I remember walking home from school in like May. And my feet would just burn underneath, it just burn and burn and burn. And my mom would come home from work. She'd have to massage them, massage them. Then um, that summer, my best, one of my best friends, I don't know if y'all know, remember Ashton Glover, she was killed, she was murdered. Um, and I just always remember this because I couldn't go look for her because at this time, my the excruciating feet pain in your feet had gotten so bad that I had to walk on the sides of my feet because the pain underneath was so bad that I, I, I would have just screamed in pain if I, if I was walking. And this is not just internal pain. You can physically see the damage that has been caused. Not at this point, at that point, but yes, now, but not at that point. It was still kind of progressing. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, we, we couldn't figure out what was wrong. The doctor was like, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. And then one day she says, go see a dermatologist. I'm like, a dermatologist? Like, that's for your skin. Why, why would I, I have knees and feet problem like I need to go see orthopedic doctor I go there the doctor looks at me she looks at my skin she takes a look at me she goes you have an MRI I say yes uh, about how long ago I was like uh, you know about six months ago um, okay and she like you know touches my skin she looks at a couple she looks at a couple pieces of paper and um, she goes so you had an MRI six months ago right I say yeah she goes all right look I can tell you right now you have something called NFD at that time, it was called nephrogenic fibrosing dermopathy. And um, they thought that it only affected the skin. And she took one look at me and she knew. Because my skin had turned into what looked like wood. Mm -hmm. It was just complete wood. And, and I couldn't walk. It, it was very painful to walk at that point. We have like 30 seconds left. What message do you want to get out? Obviously, you filed a lawsuit against the company. Yeah. GE still denies doing anything wrong with. Oh, I don't care. I know they did something wrong. And at this point, you want to get the message out to people to say what? That that they did something wrong. Watch out for <laughs> gadolinium. It's one of the worst things. I don't care if you have kidney problems or not. And if you have problems like this, man, it does not stop you. You can do whatever you want. You can you can do whatever you want. I went through. Hell and back, I had so much pain, painkillers after painkillers after painkillers. I'm not on painkillers anymore. I have my show, my podcast, All for the Culture. You know, we're on YouTube. We've been on for six months. We interview rappers. And, you know, I, I also run a real estate company. You're moving on with and your I life, but you estate. want to warn people and about want, what this, this uh, gadolinium in MRI. I want people to know, don't take gadolinium. I don't care what a doctor tells you. Don't listen to them. Please don't listen to them. And I'm telling you, they call it health care. They don't care about your health. They care about your money. Out of That's time. It. We want to thank you for coming on The Factor yes. and we wish you the best.